Fortnite, the biggest game in the world, has been unplayable since Sunday afternoon. Its colorful map and weird characters have been replaced by a black hole, and yet it's still the biggest game in the world. On Sunday afternoon, a big in-game event closed out its latest season. While these events are nothing new, this one was a bit different. This season was about time travel, with old locations returning and a giant meteor frozen over the map. During the event, a rocket launched from Dusty Depot, cracking the sky. Capsules shot from the cracks and sucked in the meteor. One capsule landed at Loot Lake, hurling players into the air. As they watched, the meteor hit Loot Lake. Familiar Fortnite items like Tomato Heads and the Battle Bus were pulled into the explosion. Eventually, the whole map was sucked in, leaving only a swirling black hole. Fortnite has been like this since the event. The game's website is just a live stream of the whole, and the live stream is now its only post on Twitter. Even though nothing is happening in Fortnite, thousands of people are watching the game on Twitch, YouTube, and Twitter, waiting to see what happens next. Numbers have occasionally appeared in the darkness surrounding the black hole. Players have traced these numbers to corresponding words in the game's collectible audio logs, spelling out the message, I was not alone, others were outside the loop, this was not calculated, the nothing is now inevitable, spooky. If you get bored watching numbers, there's a hidden minigame that can be accessed in Fortnite by entering the Konami code. The code is, of course, up, up, down, down, left, right, left, right, BA, start, though the specific buttons depend on your platform. It's simple and short, but hey, it's something to do. Developer Epic talked up this event, heralding it as, quote, the end. While it's unlikely Fortnite is going offline forever, something has definitely changed.